Your Excellency, President Irfan Ali, Prime Minister Mark Phillips, Vice President Bharat Jagdev, Former President Donald Ramutar, Members of the Guyanese Cabinet, Members of the Indo-Guyanese Community, Ladies and Gentlemen, Namaskar. Sita Ram. I am delighted to be with all of you today. First of all, I want to thank President Irfan Ali for joining us. I am deeply touched by the love and affection given to me since my arrival. I thank President Ali for opening the doors of his home to me. I also thank his family for their warmth and kindness. The spirit of hospitality is at the heart of our culture. I could feel that over the last two days with President Ali and his grandmother, we also planted a tree. It is a part of our initiative, Ek Pad Ma Ke Naam. That is a tree for mother. It was an emotional moment that I will always remember. Friends, I was deeply honored to receive the Order of Excellence, the highest national award of Guyana. I thank the people of Guyana for this gesture. This is an honor of 1.4 billion Indians. It is the recognition of the three lakh strong Indo-Guyanese community and their contributions to the development of Guyana. Friends, I have a great memories of visiting your wonderful country over two decades ago. At that time, I held no official position. I came to Guyana as a traveler, full of curiosity. Now, I have written for this land of many waters as the Prime Minister of India. A lot of things have changed between then and now. But the love and affection of my Guyanese brothers and sisters remains the same. My experience has reaffirmed you can take an Indian out of India, but you cannot take India out of an Indian.
फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई विजिटेड द इंडियन अराइवल मॉन्यूमेंट इट ब्रिंग्स टू लाइफ द लॉन्ग डिफिकल्ट जर्नी ऑफ योर एंसेस्टर्स नियरली टू सेंचुरीज एगो दे केम फ्रॉम डिफरेंट पार्ट्स ऑफ इंडिया they brought with them a different cultures languages and traditions over time they made this new land their home today these languages stories and traditions are part of the rich culture of guyana i salute the spirit of the indo guyanese community you fought for freedom and democracy you have worked to make guyana one of the fastest growing economies from humble beginnings you have risen to the top sri chedi jagan used to say it matters not what a person is born but who they choose to be he also lived this verse the son of a family of laborers he went on to become a leader of global stature <laughs> president irfan ali vice president bharat jagdev former president donald ramotar they are all ambassadors of the indo guyanese community joseph roman one of the earliest indo guyanese intellectuals ram charitar lalla one of the first indo guyanese poets shanai ardan the renowned women poet many such indo guyanis made an impact on academics and arts music and medicine friends our commonalities provide a strong foundation to our friendship three things in particular connect india and guyana deeply culture cuisine and cricket <laughs> just a couple of weeks ago i am sure you all celebrated diwali and in a few months when india celebrates holi guyana will celebrate phagwa <laughs> this year the diwali was special as ram lala returned to ayodhya after 500 years people in india remember that the holy water and silas from guyana were also sent to build 
द राम मंदिर इन अयोध्या डिस्पाइट बींग ओशन अपार्ट अवर कल्चरल कनेक्शन विद मदर इंडिया इज स्ट्रांग I could feel this when I visited the Arya Samaj Monument and Saraswati Vidya Niketan School earlier today. Both India and Guyana are proud of our rich and diverse culture. We see diversity. as something to be celebrated not just tolerated our countries are showing how cultural diversity is our strength friends whenever people of india go they take one important thing along with them the food the indo guyanese community also has a unique food tradition which has both indian and guyanese elements i am aware that dal puri <laughs> is popular here <laughs> the seven curry meal that i had at president ali's home was delicious i will remain a fond memory of me friends the love for cricket also binds our nation strongly it is not just a sport it is a way of life deeply embedded in our national identity the providence national cricket stadium in guyana stand as a symbol of our friendship kanhai kali charan chandrapaul are all well known names in india clive lloyd and his team have been a favorite of many generations young players from this region also have a huge fan base in india some of these great cricketers are here with us today many of our cricket fans enjoyed the t20 world cup that you hosted this year your cheers for the team in blue at their match in guyana could be heard even back home in india <laughs> friends this morning i had the honor of addressing the guyanese parliament coming from the mother of democracy i felt the spiritual connect with one of the most vibrant democracies in the caribbean region we have a shared history that binds us together common struggle against colonial rule love for democratic values and respect for diversity we have a sad future that we want to create aspirations for growth and development commitment towards economy and ecology and believe in a just and inclusive world order friends 
I know the people of Guyana are well wishers of India. You would be you would be closely watching the progress being made in India. India's journey over the past decade has been one of the scale, speed, and sustainability. In just 10 years, India has grown from the 10th largest economy to the fifth largest. And, and soon we will become the third largest. Our youth have made us the third largest startup ecosystem in the world. India is a global hub for e-commerce, AI, fintech, agriculture, technology, and more. We have reached Mars and the moon. From highways to highways, airways to railways, we are building state-of-art infrastructure. We have a strong service sector. Now, we are also becoming stronger in manufacturing. India has become a second largest mobile manufacturer in the world. <laughs> Friends, India's growth has not only been inspirational, but also inclusive. Our digital public infrastructure is empowering the poor. We open over 500 million bank accounts for the people. We connected these bank accounts with digital identity and mobiles. Due to this, people receive assistance directly in their bank accounts. Ayushman Bharat is the world's largest, world's largest free health insurance scheme. It is benefiting over 500 million people. We have built over 30 million homes for those in need. In just one decade, we have lifted 250 million people out of poverty. Even among the poor, our initiatives have benefited women the most. Millions of women are becoming grassroots entrepreneurs, generating jobs and opportunities. Friends, while all this massive growth was happening, we also focus on sustainability. In just a decade, our solar energy capacity grew 
थर्टी फोर कैन यू इमेजिन वी हैव मूव टवर्ड्स ग्रीन मोबिलिटी विथ ट्वेंटी परसेंट इथेनॉल ब्लाइंडिंग इन पेट्रोल एट द इंटरनेशनल लेवल टू वी हैव प्लेड अ सेंट्रल रोल इन मेनी इनिशिएटिव टू कॉम बैक क्लाइमेट चेंज the international solar alliance the global biofuel alliance the coalition for disaster resilient infrastructure many of these initiatives have a special focus on empowering the global south we have also champion the international big cat alliance Guyana with its majestic jaguars also stand to benefit from this friends last year we had hosted president irfan ali as the chief guest of the pravasi bhartiya divas we also received prime minister mark philip and vice president bharat jagdev in india together we have worked to strengthen bilateral cooperation in many areas today we have, we have agreed to widen the scope of our collaboration from energy to enterprise ayurveda to agriculture infrastructure to innovation health care to human resources and data to development our partnership also holds significant value for the wider region the second india caricom summit held yesterday it testament to the same as a member of the united nations we both believe in reform multilateralism in developing countries we understand the power of the global south we seek strategic autonomy and support inclusive development we prioritize sustainable development and climate justice and we continue to call for dialogue and diplomacy to address global crisis friends i always call our diaspora the rashtradoots you are familiar with the word raj doot but for me you are a rashtra doot you are ambassadors of indian culture and values it is said that nothing can compare with the comfort of the mother's lap you the indo ganesh community are doubly blessed you have guyana as your motherland and bharat mata bharat mata as your ancestral land today when india is a land of opportunities each one of you can play a bigger role in connecting our two countries friends 
भारत को जानिए क्वीज हैज बिन लॉन्च I call upon you to participate. Also encourage your friend from Guyana. It will be a good opportunity to understand India, its values, culture, and diversity. Friends, next year, from 13th January to 26th February. महाकुंभ विल बी हेल्ड एट प्रयागराज आई इन्वाइट यू ऑल टू अटेंड दिस गैदरिंग विथ फैमिलीज एंड फ्रेंड्स यू कैन ट्रैवल टू बस्ती और गोंडा फ्रॉम वेर मेनी ऑफ यू केम you can also visit the ram temple at ayodhya there is another invite it is for the pravasi bhartiya divas that will be held in bhubaneswar in january if you come you can also take the blessings of mahaprabhu jagannath in puri now with so many events and invitations i hope to see many of you in india soon once again thank you all for the love and affection you have shown to me thank you thank you very much and special thanks to my friend ali thanks a lot